Now we're going to look at the last similarity theorem, which is side angle side. And I've created this applet where I have two triangles that have two sides that are proportional. Uh, the blue is proportional to blue. The red is proportional to red. And the included angles, the angle right between the red and the blue sides. B is not included between the red and the blue. So you see how the two sides are shared on that angle. So the angle actually has touches the blue side and the red side. That means it's included. So the two included angles are incongruent. You can see they're both the, the green angles and they're 65 degrees. So again, the red sides are proportional because I used a scale factor of two here. If I changed it to three, you would see that the sides are still proportional. There, let me close that for a second. I don't know why that came up. And I'll use a nice easy number like three. And you can see the sides are still proportional and the included angle is still congruent. Okay, so the question is, if I do that, do these two triangles have to be similar? Well, let me go ahead and look at the third side here. Okay, well the third side you can see is also proportional. In this case, the scale factor is 2. You can see I've set it there. So 9.1 times 2 is 18.2. So all three sets of sides are proportional. Well, if all three sets of sides are proportional, it's similar. But let's go ahead and really confirm that, and I'm going to show all the angles. You can see that all of the angles are congruent, so it's definitely similar. When all three angles in a triangle are congruent, the triangles have to be similar. So the question to you is if I have two similar um, side angle side, are the angles and or sides always, con always sometimes or never congruent? Well, hopefully you can see which ones are congruent and which ones aren't necessarily congruent. So this leads to the side angle side similarity theorem or SAS and it says if two sides of one triangle are proportional to two sides of another triangle and their included angles are congruent, then the triangles are similar. So if we're going to use it, I've got this example and I've got triangles below are similar with a scale factor of 5. The only thing I've helped you out with so far is I know angle P and angle D, those angles go together. They're corresponding. So I want to prove that these two triangles are similar by using sine angle side. So I gave some values. I know RP is 3, DF is 15, EF is 30, and DE is 20. Which one length must we know and what must it be in order to prove the triangles are similar by side angle side? Well, one thing that's going to be really help me is I know the scale factor. The scale factor is 5. So that means 3 times 5, oh, that's a 15. But I can also go backwards. I can look at that small side and medium and large, it helps to do that, and divide by the scale factor. So 15 divided by 5 is 3. And those two sides go together. Then I'm going to try this side, DE. Why am I doing this side? Well, it's because th these two here, if I know that angle's kind of shared, P goes with D, that meant F has to go with R and E has to go with Q. So that is the other side and it has to be 4. Okay, since those are proportional, if, D, if PQ is 4, then we can prove the triangles are similar by side angle side. And my similarity, and basically, let me go back, my similarity statement would be, say I did RPQ, would be similar to FDE. So to reflect, how does side angle side prove that two triangles are similar? We really used inductive reasoning on our argument. What does it mean when an angle is included? That's very important. Remember, we did that in triangle congruence, and now we're using it in triangle similarity. Will all triangle congruence theorems and postulates work to prove similarity? So going back to the previous semester, remember we learned um, also angle side angle, hypotenuse leg. Why don't I need an angle side angle theorem or a hypotenuse leg theorem? Um, and then the question is, are all of these theorems, can I prove triangles are congruent? Can I prove that triangles are congruent by side, 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 angle, side? What about angle, angle, angle? 